GTF. Do you know what that stands for? Gluten free. Except that my mind uh, automatically translates that to uh, girlfriend. So uh, all I see is little signs that just go, salted caramel slice, girlfriend. It's like about little, uh, little cranberry muffin, girlfriend. How about a hummingbird cake, girlfriend? Uh, <laughs> I'm like, you know what, sassy food? I think you've won me over. I'll uh, have a little bit m more of you, delicious blueberry friend. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> because I can't read. It actually says blueberry free -owned. You see, I think when Jesus turned the water into wine, it took him fucking ages and there was grapes involved. And you can see why they would have left those details out, don't you think? Because you're never going to get a book into the all-time bestsellers list if your most interesting chapter is the one about the tradie who makes homebrew. Like most people my age, I am... Um 23. <laughs> a lot of people call me a pretentious asshole, even though I insist on anus. I carry a recessive black gene, which means even though I'm white, I still have a small chance of having a black baby. So when you think about it, my girlfriend has a get out of jail free card to have sex with any black guy that she wants. And if she has a baby, I couldn't tell. <laughs> but someone told me, uh, time out, I can't believe that I'm about to say this in front of a group of people. Uh, time in. Okay, so uh, I somehow heard, it got into my head that if you slept on a book that you would absorb part of the contents of the book in your sleep, right? That's what, I don't know, I don't know how I heard it. I just like, yes, this is genius. I'm going to do this. And every time she's like, let's get freaky. I just kept thinking of an old Chinese man peeing on her. I was like, what the fuck? I can't have this discussion with you right now because I keep thinking of this. She's a good girlfriend. There's an old man sitting next to me making love to his tonic and gin. <laughs> Billy Joel, why the fuck are you still sitting next to this guy? <laughs> I chuck the Teletubbies on and I'll take whatever my favourite thing is, right? And you should all try it. I'm not telling you to fucking what to take, I'm just telling you do it, give it a crack, right? And this is what happens. You put the Teletubbies on, you go, oh, I'm sort of mildly entertained by the suggestion of Teletubby Custard, but I don't quite get what the fuck's going on, right? And then once the shit takes effect, you aren't watching this bullshit children's show anymore. No. You are transformed into a magical disco, right? And you're just going, fucking yeah, how good's this shit? Fucking yes! And you're just fucking dancing with your children, right? And then your missus comes home, right? And she walks in and she doesn't think her husband's a drug addict, no. She thinks, oh my God, what a great father. Look at him dancing with the kids. I love him, right? 